Hi, I'm Colin with Thuya Wood Art, and I'd like to show you how to install the forged pintle hinges I sell on my website onto your gate. These pintle hinges are designed to let your gate open both ways by having the pintle be more in line with the gate. First, lay out the hinges where you want them on the gate. Front or back doesn't matter, just lay them so the pintle hole is in line with the wood, or facing down as you can see I have done here. It's important that the hinges are parallel and line up evenly with each other. I make sure of this by using a straight edge and also by measuring the distance between the hinges. Because I make my gates from hand-split red cedar, they are not perfectly flat like milled wood. So sometimes I have to notch the hinge into the wood to get it to sit flat and line up with the other hinge. If you are using milled wood, most likely you won't have to do this. Once the hinges are positioned where you like, the next step is to drill holes for the carriage bolts. I'm using 5 16 inch galvanized carriage bolts that are two and a half inches long. For bigger gates, I would use 3 8 carriage bolts. I like to drill directly through the holes in the hinge using it as a guide, but you could also mark out the holes with a pencil and drill without the hinge in place. Drop the carriage bolts through the holes with the head flat against the hinge and apply a washer and nut on the back side, tightening until the washer snugs into the wood a little. With the hinges installed on your gate, you are now ready to hang the gate.